program has completely changed their lives. And I should know better, because not too long ago, I was in their shoes. You see, I've been nearsighted since high school, but I only realized how much it had advanced a few years ago when my coworkers started mocking me for bringing every paper two inches away from my face so I could read. They used to call me Squinter, like bullies on the school playground. Our new colleagues didn't even know my real name. Squinter was just perfect for me. I felt ashamed, humiliated, and isolated by everyone. When I finally had the courage to go see a doctor, I found out that my myopia had already gone to negative 1.50. So I got a prescription for glasses, and he assured me that if I wear them all the time, it would stop from advancing. Now, the first week I wore them, I couldn't get rid of the gruesome headaches unless I took the glasses off for at least an hour. And sometimes that wasn't enough. I just had to go lay down because I had the feeling my head was going to pop open. And the worst part is that everyone thinks you're just whining for no reason, even though it can drive you absolutely insane. You have to live with this annoying pain every single minute of every single day. So I went back to the doctor and asked him for contact lenses. I thought, spending all that money on glasses when I could have just stuffed some invisible little lenses in my eyes and that's it. Yet again, boy oh boy, was I wrong. The contacts were even worse. I think eyewear should come with a huge warning sign saying, this will most likely hurt some way or another. I got the monthly disposable lenses, so it was supposed to be easy peasy. But these things inevitably turn you into a clean freak, obsessed with every single little germ or speck of dust that may wander around. I followed every hygiene rule to the letter, every single day, except for one. One night, I just couldn't find my special cleansing solution, so I rinsed them with tap water. Next day, my eyes started to itch like crazy, and I couldn't stop tearing up. I looked like I'd been crying for hours. My wife rushed me to the hospital, where I found out I had gotten some bacteria in my contacts, which were getting pretty comfy inside my eyes. I had to put antibiotic drops for 14 days, which stung like hell and left me unable to see clearly. And since I couldn't wear contacts, I had to go back to the glasses. Only that, surprise, surprise, my glasses were now useless. I put them on, I took them off, wiped them clean put them on again and repeated the whole process about 10 times until I realized how ridiculous it was. The glasses were too weak for me now, so I made another appointment with my doctor to find out why my vision was getting worse, despite my constant wear of contacts and glasses. He didn't seem surprised at all. He didn't even flinch. Apparently, a lot of people come back with the same problem. Being naive like I am, I asked why. His answer? Get this. He said, because people don't wear their glasses properly. I opened my mouth to say something, but I just couldn't gather myself to ask, what's the proper way to wear a pair of glasses? You put them on, and then you leave them there. What else is there? I thought maybe I was lucky enough to get the worst doctor in the area. But I asked other nearsighted and farsighted friends if they had the same problem, and they all confessed that they've had to change their lenses so many.